hi guys today in this video we are going to create custom drop down menu with image as you can see so this is it we are going to create so let's get started Okay, let's go in a style and a style this. okay this is looking good now we will go back in html and add a list okay let's go in style and style this list Okay, now add a few more items, a few more items. Okay, this is looking perfect. Now we need to find a way to open and close this list, this drop down. So for that we are going to create a JS file. We already have a JS file. We are going to open it and connect the JS file in HTML at the bottom. Okay, our JS file is linked. Now go in JS. and we will target our drop down
ok this is it now we will take our drop down and add a event listener pass the arrow function and inside this function we are going to take list dot class list dot toggle and we are going to toggle a class which is going uh, which is going to be called as show we don't have this show class we will create in css first so we will go back and in list we are going to add display none and we are going to add one class which is show and in this class we will add display block that's it now our javascript file is toggling this class when we click our drop down so if i click then you can see it's opening and it's closing opening and closing okay this is working now if we click on some country like say canada then it's closing but it's not changing the value here so which is now we are going to do so for that we are going to take our list dot add event listener and pass the arrow function const image equals to event dot target dot query selector img let's log it first so that we can see what is going on console and if we click here and if we click nothing is happening so oh we are not logging it sorry my fault log img yeah now it should work if I click yeah we are getting this image okay and for text we are going to do cost text equals to event dot target dot query selector dot text and we are going to set this to selected selected image dot src equals to img dot src one go and then again select dot inner html equals to text dot inner html this is it it should work now if i change click to canada then this is canada is active now so that's all for this video thank you so much for watching hope you guys enjoyed i will meet you in the next one